Alright guys, let's recap the uh, last war I had. It's gonna call this Asian Clan 001, because we have more of them coming. <laughs> we won this war by one star. Uh, and the final attack were to uh, Ian. And we've got war events. And you can see. Um, when uh, Nick got defeated, our number four, he was losing by one star. Warren made it equal, and then Gulp won his war. So well done to Gulp. Let's watch some attacks. Okay, first up we have Sammy. Going in from the top. Good goal deployment. Good rage and war breakers. Unlucky that war breakers went off target. That was quite hard to aim, but the base is designed that way anyway. Dangle the witches. Good spell placement. That's a town hall down. It was Max Peckers doing work in the centre there. Taking a lot of damage, but dealing a lot of damage. There's the two star. Let's speed this up. Those witches are really, really powerful. The amount of skeletons you get from those witches at max. And there we go. Great attack, Sammy. Well done. On to the next attack. Which will be... Ian's attack. This is the attack that won the war. Good gun placement. We're liking war breakers, but he won us the war. We're not going to draw on that. Dangle the peckers. Good spell placement. Rage peckers through the war quite fast. Good heal placement to combat the enemy CC. I'm guessing he prefers to have the extra space for an extra pecker, taking out the wall breakers. A rage pecker will get through a wall quite fast, but I still prefer wall breakers. Let's speed this up. He's a town all nine, so four peckers. He, he makes it work. At town all eight, we couldn't do that. Then now to the next one, this is Warren. This was the next last attack when he equaled the score. And it's gonna be Hogs. Lowering that CC sir, CC out. Very important in a hog attack. It's one of two things that are mess up a hog attack. The CC and the second thing is the uh, dual big bombs. Which there could be some on here. That top right archer tower below there, and the top left archer tower. Hogs flying everywhere, good heal placement. Some of the lavas coming out, one big bomb on the left. One on the right takes out the group of hogs, but luckily the hogs are split up, so not all of them are boom. And there we go. Well done, Warren. Next up, I believe we have Parson. Yep, correct. Taking out the uh, flower base. I don't think we've seen this in war before. I can't remember. Uh, good rage placement. Good war break placement. Well, lucky not to get into the center. Splitting up, that's good. Golem going each way, wizard splitting up equally as well. And Pekka's splitting up, so pretty good. Taking out the base pretty fast. 
I don't think this attack could have gone any better, really. King still at 4 health with the ability still left. A golem still alive. And there goes the rage to get through faster. Not needed. And there we go. Well done, Parson. I believe that's the second time he made it onto the uh, YouTube video. And there we go. There's Nook getting his um, signature six stars again, as always. Jaguar, he was really useful clearing up. And just because I want to, we're going to show Nyx as the last attack. I have not watched this one yet, but I'm quite impressed with the way he attacks. Lowering all the CC out. Take him to the bottom. Nope, it's going to lower them over the top of the head fence. And then lighten the head. Nope, where's the tower? I was wrong. Doesn't happen often, but I was wrong. There, go, there goes the giants. There's the wizards. Good war breakers. No witch in the CC. And that base has got totally wrecked. Yeah, good job, Nick. <laughs> Everyone was over to that last builder hut in the corner. So it's a uh, uh, oh, what's the word? It's a good habit to put down the arches and those builder huts in the corner. Many a times we see ninety nine percent and builder huts still standing in the corner. So yeah, that was the uh, last war. Well done to Sammy, Ian, for pretty much winning the war for us. I mean, everyone else really helped. Posim's attack were really good. Uh, Jagger cleared up low. This current war, you can see we have two Town Hall 10s, three Town Hall 9s. And the other clan have exactly the same. So this is going to be another close war, we think. And that's all I've got for today. Until next time.